okay here is the ingredients of making my coffee therapy this is coffee mom that's a bit we we ordered it from oregon and this is organic fair trade shade grown bird friendly high altitude and single origin and my husband is already pre-grind uh, pre-grind it with our grinder and a 32 ounce of that i mean 32 ounce of water this is just a single session so if you want to double it you can also do it just double the portion and save it in the refrigerator and you can also save it in the refrigerator for three days so if you want to do it two times a day you can but that's quite expensive two, okay. two and a half quarts of that water, of water and the coffee we do this every other day especially with the thing going on right now five minutes boiling and the next of that is 15 minutes simmering now it's time to switch to another 15 minutes simmering the lid on. A little below medium medium makes it almost yeah. like it's boiling because it's okay. now I'm preparing our coffee enema and my husband is already pre-made this. In Gerson therapy they they use coffee enema as part of their cleansing with their uh, for their cancer patient okay where's my I use I use co coffee press to strain my coffee So far, we've we been doing this for the past a year or so. Like I think I started this last January of 9, 2019, and now it's COVID time, pandemic time. So I think my body needs it more than ever. So far, I've been to Philippines. I I come back, and I don't. I've been okay. I guess with all those coughing from the plane, uh, from the airport, from all the stress that we've been through at the domestic in Lagindian where I thought there's a riot in there. Oh my lord, that was scary. You don't blame those people get mad because of the cancellation of their flight. And I'm glad we're home. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Now, oh, by the way, last night, um, guys i'm in my bathroom now this is my solution and this is my enema bag this is made out of silicon non-toxic and i'm just gonna go ahead and pour this in my bag okay I'm, i want to make sure that this is closed so it will not just shoot out so what i do is I'm gonna just open this and and after that I also have here a coconut oil which you get it's gonna lubricate the nozzle that goes on your end zone and obviously I'm not gonna pull my pants down so that's, that's something that I'm not gonna do in front of you guys but I'm just gonna demonstrate it to you I'm also some people they have hard time of holding the 
coffee enema but i i have good tolerance on holding it so i don't lay in the bathroom i lay on on in the comfort of my bed and i'm just gonna demonstrate it to you in there okay what else okay i have my coffee enema bag hanging and i'm just gonna let the gravity pull the coffee down while i'm resting on my right side